Russians change night operation tactics near Vulidar. The Russian occupation forces have almost stopped assault and sabotage activities at night on the Vulidar front and are using this time to replenish their forces and bring in reserves. Colonel Alexei Dmitrashkivsky spokesman for the Joint Press Office of the Armed Forces of the Tavria Front told it, The enemy has slightly changed its tactics on this front. It has stopped attacking our positions at night. Over the last few days, the number of assault actions in this area has ranged from three to four. Previously, they were conducting disturbing fire, sabotage, and reconnaissance and assault groups were constantly working. Today, we can observe a slightly different tactic. At night, they are trying to restore and replenish reserves and personnel. At At the same time, the spokesman of the armed forces of the Tavria Front noted the occupiers will likely continue their assault operations as they have a task from Putin to reach the borders of Donetsk and Luhansk oblasts. As for the enemy's further actions, whether they will continue, I think they will. However, their actions today have changed dramatically. They no longer have the capabilities with which they began the assault and offensive on this front. In my opinion, it will take quite some time to restore on this front so that they can fully attack. I think it will take at least until May to June, but the enemy will still constantly disturb this front because they have a clearly defined task for their president. I think the situation will change somewhat, but we are going to hold these positions.